Welcome to another episode of A Satisfactory. It is time to set up a proper biomass burner facility to keep our power going um, and clean up some of the spaghetti. It was nice getting it out of my system. Um, I'm going to do my best. No, I will go beyond my best to uh, make sure this doesn't happen again with the clipping and just things going off at all weird angles. But uh, it was nice. Brought back a lot of memories. Now, but before we do that, um, I gathered up some materials to, um, let's see, was this the one? Yeah, this one. So we can get the map, the MAM, uh, an object scanner. Really never used those. Personal storage, that'll help. And uh, three more inventory slots. So yeah, we'll select that one. And oop, active one. So let's uh, drop all these in here. Boom, boom. Oh man, I used up all my wire, damn it. Okay. There, got it. Ma'am. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, um, oh crap, I guess we're going to be forced to do that. Okay, um, you know what, let's pop uh, one down and just uh, get that going. So, uh, what, oh, uh, we needed wire and some more reinforced iron plates. Okay, so let's get uh, wire, bink. And you know what? We'll, we'll take. Oh, uh, we'll take. Oh, let me try this again. There, and we'll drop all that back in there. Okay, we should be good for a while with that. And uh, boom, 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 we should have the materials that we need to make the reinforced iron plate because we only need three more of them. Yes, boom. Let's do it. There, we got five of them. Total. All right. Let's let's pop this thing down. Boom. And nope, no notification from Ada. All right. Uh, let's see. Alien megafauna. Oh, you know what? We we got some of this stuff. Yeah, yeah. Nutrients. Um. Oh yeah. Yeah, we've got all three of those. Um, let's grab them. Let's see what the hell we're gonna get from all of this. Um, let's see here. Boom, 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 and boom. Oh, and I turned down the graphic setting from ultra to high. Um, yeah, that, the ultra was way going way beyond what we needed. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, let's start the research. We'll get that. Okay. After its distinctive color, is compatible with the human digestive system and has been added to the object scanner. Oh, well, thank you. Oh. Okay. Well, let's get the pale berry done. Confirm. This fruit, dubbed the pale berry, due to its tendency to stay light in color even when ripe, is compatible with the human digestive system and has been added to the object scanner. Well, thank you. How research oh. is available? Well, let, let's get this next one. We're just going to do everything. This mushroom, dubbed bacon agaric, due to its uncanny resemblance to raw bacon, is compatible with the human digestive system and has been added to the object scanner. Further research is available. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, we got a ways to go. Modular frames, uh, pipe, and wire. Okay, alien megafauna. I know we had, was it this one? Yeah, it was this one. Let's do it. <gasps> the remains researched belong to an organism now dubbed the fluffy-tailed hog. It has many characteristics that would likely classify it among the Suidae family were it native to Earth. 
Hog remains can now be made into alien protein, and additional research may reveal options for improving pioneer safety during exploration. I would be okay being more safe when we're out there. Okay. Yes, yes. Not. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know we're going to need that medical inhaler sooner or later. Let's see, what is this? Uh, inflated pocket dimensions. Oh, plus six. Okay. Thousand K. We got a ways to go. Okay. Uh, got slightly distracted with what we were going to do on this episode. Um, boom. So let's put this, this, and this back. Boom. Sort. Got it. Um... Yeah, let's put those guys away also. All right. Oh, For, oh man. We, oh, we don't have very much uh, concrete going on, do we? Ooh. Because I, I wanted to start laying down some foundations and... Uh, not even 500. Okay, well, let's go get some iron plates. Where were the iron plates? Uh, were you in here? Nope, nope, nope. Man, that's coming along nice. There we go. Uh, we'll just grab it all. Okay. So I'm thinking of doing it up here. Now, the reason for that is we can set it and forget it and just have it sitting there in the background. Ooh, nice. And the star is setting. Oh, but we got the one friend up here that likes to play. Oh, yeah. Oh, ooh, there's some more bacon. Oh, oh. <gasps> In a slug. Oh crap, I forgot about that one and that one up there. Oh. Oh, and there's some more bacon. Okay, and just so we can survive a little bit longer, let's get the pale berries here and the ones over here. Oh, I guess I already, oh, I already got those. Damn it. And they're not back yet. Okay. Uh, first things first. Uh, we saw... Yeah, I noticed this one first on this episode. We'll get this guy. He looks awfully lonely. And let's see here. We got to put some foundations down. Now that we've got all these ramp. Oh, 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 oh. No, not the chainsaw. Oh, I talked about you coming in. Oh, oh, oh. Um, let's drop these in here. We will we'll exchange them and Okay. Yeah. Samples of unknown alien <sighs> species acquired. Their weaponized plasma is most likely stored as a stable chemical substance in an organ close to their mouth, and only turns volatile when exposed to one of the chemical elements in the air. Research the remains in the MAM to establish classification and potential countermeasures. Okay, we can do that. But like I was saying before we were rudely interrupted, we have got all these foundations. Um, let's put this one on... Uh, let's go with six. Okay, so we take this now. Um, was it R to change the style? We want Zoop. And we'll just uh, do something like that. Gotcha. Oh, yeah. This semi-slug species seems to persist entirely through absorbing and storing energy from its surroundings. Okay. Studying this could provide new methods for improving fixit production line efficiency. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Okay, we can do that. And let's see, the other one... Uh, yeah, there it is, right up there. Okay. And... Hmm. <laughs> Oop, what am I doing? Uh, let's get number six. And we'll do something, uh, no, kind of like that. That should get us up there. Maybe? Yeah, we'll get it. Okay, boom. 
Nice. And, ooh, oh, I can't remember what's up there, but I think there's a purple one up there on top of that arch, too. And again, I, I shouldn't be saying that um, because I don't want to ooh, assume anything and because things have changed. Now, um, what we should do, let's see here. So, so if we choose ooh, the foundations and it just changes, nope, nope, not that one. Okay, hold on. Quick, oh, quick switch is E. Okay, so that's two, the four, and the one. Okay. So then if we want the other foundations, which we will do, um, let's put in these guys. There, we'll switch it to that. Okay. So we'll, uh, we can hold down control and put it on the, the world grid. That get out above it? Not quite. Okay. I guess we'll have to go somewhere up here to do it. And I don't know why I'm doing it by hand, but I need to get the chainsaw back in there. And can we reach you from here? Anybody? Somebody? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. I did not want to do that. But since we're down here... Okay, let's work our way back up there. Okay. Uh-oh. I'm showing an example of how not to fight these things, and you can still take quite a bit of hits before you die. Okay. Alright, all right. no more distractions, no more distractions. We will get our little power plant going. <gasps> they came back. Good. All right. Now. Now let's go lay down the foundations and then we'll come back and start tearing this down. Yeah. It'll be nice to when we get some ladders and some conveyor, uh, not lifts, but the conveyor, not the conveyor poles. Damn it. What, the ladders uh, where you can stack the conveyors. I can't remember what the hell they are. Which, All right. We'll start clear cutting. And I'm not going to go for that. Okay, this looks like the high spot up here. So let's do it. And we'll do something like right here. There we go. creatures in the way. Hey, sorry, little guy. You gotta go. Did that scare you off? Nope. How about this? Go, go. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Shoo, shoo. Get out of the factory. Get out of the factory. Go, go. Go over there with your mate. Thank you. Oh, okay, let's get it done. Uh, 
this we'll uh, we'll keep this as a permanent starter factory and power station and we'll start by dropping in let's see we're we will have you know what Let, let's do this we'll have it go this direction obviously and we'll drop it that in the center and okay that'll be one storage container for let's see here leaves we'll put leaves on that side and then we will put yeah, let's see there we go uh, boom wood in this one there boom All right, let's go tear, tear everything down. We'll drop off the power slugs and everything else that we picked up here. Well, not everything else, but uh, the bacon, berries, nuts. Uh, boom, cure. Was it stingers? Yeah, spitter remains, uh, slugs. Yep, all right. And I'm pretty sure we can uh, scan them here in the MAM, but we're not going to do that yet. I'm gonna stay focused, as focused as possible. All right, and oh, we'll take that one, take that, all of those, and of course, all of this, and you. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we'll get this going. Uh gonna have to see what the ratio is or the recipe for the fuel how much it's going to end up consuming can we make it yes and with this playthrough i'm going to do my best to not have everything bunched up together uh, keeping it tight. You know what we could do too? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, and we'll, okay, let's do this. There we go. We'll start again. We'll live dangerously right here on the edge. So if anything happens, uh, we're going off into the void. It'll force us to be more careful. Yeah, all right. So now we take the constructor. We got a shortcut of zero. Yeah, let's, um, oh, we could put it half there. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, and we'll put you there. Let's see, uh, leaves will go in here, and the wood will go in there. We'll make this biomass wood, and biomass leaves. Okay, and... No, we haven't gotten the logistics too. That's okay. We'll get there. Okay, let's turn our torch off. All right, boom, boom. All that's the biomass. Um, seven. Oop. Let's go E. All right, so we'll drop in a merger here. It's just basically setting up the same way we had it before. Nope, nope. See, I. My force of habit, I wanted to go really tight there, and nope, just stretching things out. Oh, oh, yes, and that's right, there's uh, the default mode. In fact, we can probably show it better from here. That, there, torch is off. Where's the ladder to get up? Oh, man, hover pack, jet pack, looking forward to them. Okay, so we can, that's the default, and then was it? E was straight. Oh, so it's going to do it. Oh, because it's lined up that way. Okay. 
because with the straight, it'll make these nice 90 degree turns. All right. So then we'll have it come out here. And all the biomass will go into a storage container. And then the biomass will go in here to be turned into solid biofuel. And then one more storage container or all of the solid biofuel and I'm going to take uh, just that stack oh and, oh oh we had we had more biomass yep plus all the biofuel right now boom and over time this is gonna work out lickety split right, let's put the biomass in there biomass in there okay so we'll get this up and running and have it do its thing. In fact, we could probably even put a power pole like right here. And then we'll take this to there and that one to there. Okay. And temporarily, uh, we will run This here to the edge. And we'll hook it up to our power system down there now. And so we just need a free pole. You're gonna give it to me right there? Nope. Oh, there, uh, how about that one? Oh, you're not even connected. Where are you? Yes, you are. Confirmed. Yes. And it's working. Okay. Hmm. So just to keep our power going here, we'll keep the biomass burners running that direction. Okay. And... Oh, I guess it would have been faster that way. Okay. You know what? Let's take down this tree. Oh, more pale berries. Thank you. Okay. And then... Yeah. I'll grab up some more leaves because we need to be efficient. We're not going to waste too much. There will be waste, but hopefully not too much. Okay. So let's take this. <gasps> okay. No worries. No worries. We can take some of the. We'll rip some of this up. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Okay. All right, we got that. Um, do we have the materials for biomass burners? Yes, we do. Okay, so let's see here. Hmm, <laughs> we might have to redo some of this. Okay, so if that's in there, wait, wait, is that the center? Nope, that is. Oh, let's turn it this way. There we go. Okay. Yeah. In fact, let's drop a splitter right here in the middle. There. Then we will put Okay, so the power pole's right there.
Okay, missing rods. Oh, man. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What is this? Quartz? Raw quartz? Let's take it. Unknown crystalline mineral. Collected. Yes! This mineral is composed of the same chemical elements as quartz and may yield similar industrial functions. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Okay, let's do it. Quartz. Uh, boom. We'll research it. Start research. There we go. <gasps> the crystal silica was a previously unknown variation of quartz with uniquely large and flawless crystals normally only found in synthetic quartz the industrial application of this mineral will follow that of its synthetic counterpart specifically in communication and exploration technologies Okay, let's get this. Uh, we'll grab some more concrete. And we'll take all of it. Okay. Yep, we're going to keep, keep that running. And we'll set this thing up and get it going. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, just a little bit. You know what? And we could probably disconnect the power sources. And there we go from this and have it just running on these guys but uh, let's see how can we we're getting there our factory slowly but surely we'll be able to run around here pretty damn good and son of a biscuit eater Ugh. did not see that okay well there we go a sip of mountain dew boo dew mystery flavor and my guess is it's going to be cotton candy. I haven't looked it up yet, but that is what I am leaning towards. Cotton candy. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Go, 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 go. Okay. You can hang out there for a while then. All right. Um, no, three, four, let's, let's, we'll put down eight and see what it does. Um, oh, come on. No, wait, wait, what the hell's going on here? There we go. Why didn't you line up with it? Oh, there, there, hmm. Okay, and we'll put a splitter right there. Right there. Boom. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, you. Okay, let's try this again. We've got a splitter. Let's have it going in the correct direction. All right, get this one. And one more. Okay, so let's see, mark one belts will move 60 items per minute. And solid biofuel four per minute. Okay. We can do that. It'll be fi we could put fifteen in. All right, and how much is this producing? If it's running at a hundred percent, which it's not, so okay. Um, yeah, we'll do. I don't know. We, we'll, we'll, let's start with eight. We will start with eight and go from there and see what the hell happens. And we're gonna have to redo this whole line just because I said I was gonna keep everything nice and neat. Okay. And plus it was going to start to get to me after a while. 
if we put this in here and what we can do is we can pop it right there and solid biofuel boom and we'll take one of them back there we go good good we'll make sure all of that's working now uh there we go so it's on this side okay so let's see we could go one there you know what we'll we'll we'll, we'll be symmetrical Okay, then we'll take this one. Oh. And we'll plop one there. Right. Oh, that's why. Okay. And we'll plop one there. And I did it on the wrong side. Oh, oh, damn it. No, because these are mirrored. Okay, so I'll put one there, one there, and one there. There, we'll connect that one. Okay. All right, manifolds are being set up. Eventually, this they'll get some uh, biomass down here. Not in a rush. We've got time, and we'll do this and uh, that one. All right, let's clean up our mess here a little. Uh, boom, boom, boom. We're getting there. Okay. 120. Oh, oh, 120. Let's see. These are putting out 30. Oh, oh. What are we missing? Oh, we've got to tie them in together. So let's take this and go right there. And there it is. 240 capacity. That's what we were after. Let's see, we got eight. Okay, we know that will work. Oh man, and just having this automated, oh my gosh, such a relief. Okay, so, um, let's see, four, five, six, seven. There, we'll go 14. And if we have to, we can set up another line of biomass burners to increase our production. There, nice, very, very nice. Okay, so let's get this stuff going and we gotta turn it that way. Oh man, having those dashed lines, oh man, that makes such a big difference. Ooh. Okay. Oh, and th at some points you can just, you don't even have to move your cursor. You can just uh, point it right there at the biomass burner or the splitter. Click once and click twice. If the, if, uh, if the buildings are close enough, it'll do that. Um, but like this, going from splitter to splitter, it won't do it. So... Just point at it. They're done. Okay, we'll get that. That. You gonna let me drop one there? Thank you. And we'll drop that. That. You gonna let me drop one there? Nope. Okay.
go. That's looking good. Okay, so we got 14. That's 300. Wait, is that right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh oh, did I put 16 in? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. What the hell did I count? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, 14. Okay, 14 times 30, that's 300, 420. All right. Everything is connected. Is my math off? I okay. My math has got to be off somewhere. Okay, these are. Yeah, thirty per. Okay. Thirty times fourteen. Well, let's open up the calculator. Oh, not plus. Yeah, 420. Oh, is it because there was no fuel in some of these? That's what's going on. Right, 300. So what are you saying? 270. But you should all be tied in. All right. Where did I miss it? I missed a connection somewhere. No, it's looking good. We got smoke coming out on some of them. Okay. Well, we'll just keep doing what we're doing. In fact, let's uh, let, let's help it along. Uh, boom, we'll start at the back end. And start primarying it and okay we'll do this in fact let's uh split split and a split put 50 in there 50 in there because right now it's not consuming any of it because we have nothing connected to it all right and uh, 49 will go there and we'll put 50 in there. There we go. And you know what? We'll put another... No more in there. Okay, 420. Okay, good. Good. Killer deal. Now, let's go put the rest of this in there. And, bum, 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 bum. and we'll keep one stack for ourselves for the chainsaw. Oh my goodness, that's right. I forgot we've got all this we need to clean up too. Boom, 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 boom. And we'll take that and that one. Gone. Okay. So now... We will need this guy to make oh we can't quite read there we go and this is going to be solid biofuel and we'll put biomass in there yep and boom boom and we'll have another one here for the actual biomass And bum, bum, bum. then we'll have a merger. Getting used to these shortcuts. Love it. Slowly but surely we're getting there. Yeah, and as soon as we hit the Mark II belt, we'll go ahead and upgrade these belts. Because, boom, this requires 120 per minute of the biomass. And we're only moving 60 per minute. But uh, all in due time, all in due time, we'll just get this up and running. And let's see here. So we got that, that. So let's put a constructor down. Um, yeah, uh, let's, let's do one like right there. 
And we'll put another one right there. Oh, maybe not quite right there. In fact, let's do this. And this is all part of Satisfactory. Getting things uh, set up. How looking nice and neat if you wish to or however you want it to be okay so if we put this here is that gonna work and then we put another one right there and as long as we can tie it in yep okay so this side is going to be leaves and this side will be mass wood All right, so. Boom, boom, boom. We'll put you there. And. You right there. And this is going to be a leaves. And this will be wood. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See, this is going to be coming out at 300 per minute. We we're, we got a long ways before we can get the belts fast enough. All right. So there we got that and that and that and this and that. Let's take a look at our line. OK, we'll drop a power pole right there and one right there. So we'll take this and tie it into this one. Go there, and that one will be with that one. And then we'll run another power pole and plop it to right there, even though it's not quite lined up with it. I'm okay for now. Oh, that's because I already connected it. All right. So then we will take this and hit this one. Oh, that's, oh, that's right. We need all those leaves to get in there and then it'll start firing up. There it goes. Okay. Yes. All oh, glorious biomass. Yes. Come on in. Come on in. Oh, yes. Okay. Then all of this, oh, it's already backing up there. Yeah, little by little, we're getting there. Okay. Why we're here. Uh, we got to make some room for our uh, starter factory, our permanent starter factory. And we'll leave it up uh, ooh, probably for quite a long time until we get those bigger production runs uh, factories going. All right, I'm going after wood because it's the most efficient one. And I'm keeping an eye out for friends who wish to dance. Come on, they're playing our song. There we go. Thank you, I enjoyed it. Berries. Let's grab them. Nope, I already got them. You know, let's see. What's. Oh, there's a big guy. Hey. Plus, you know, if we clear out the trees over here on this side, we really won't be seeing them from, um, from our main factory because uh, these little hills and mountains will be hiding it. So I'm okay with clear cutting here. <laughs> I, I get a little bit too much enjoyment out of this. Oh, bacon. Thank you. Oh, more bacon. Well, probably what we'll do here soon is uh, go out exploring and looking for some hard drives, crash sites, and uh, pick up some other material. 
Oh, wait. Hold on. Is that... Is that one of them? <gasps> it is a Mercer Sphere. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, we drift when we swim. How the hell? Let's collect it. Oh, hot damn. Hot damn. Biologist Dr. D.M. Mercer was the first to recognize the presence and probable nature of these alien artifacts. These chain melted state spheres are named in his honor. Each sphere emits a unique oh. symbol. Research it in the MAM to establish locally appropriate classification. Okay, I will. Hmm. There we go. That was a big swig of dew to celebrate that one. Oh. Okay. Uh, where were we? Oh, yeah. We were clear-cut in the forest. Yeah. I'm, I'm, not, I'm just going uh, with the trees and whatever leaves happen to be in the area that get destroyed, too. That is good enough for me. Oh, bacon. Thank you. And yeah, well, well, we're gonna take this off on this side. What the hell? We gotta use up everything we can. See, like in my first playthrough, you know what? Let's go for it, because I think there's a hard uh, crash site just right over here. Um, as I was walking around here clear cutting, it reminded me of it. Okay. Let's see, is this is mycelia? Oh, limestone and mycelia. The fruit of this fungus like flora does not seem to show much potential for use. Okay. However, its mycelial network is worth further investigation. Ooh. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Okay. I I can do that. Yeah, look at all this. Oh, just just oh yeah. Take it all, take it all. Oh, oh, oh look at 1400 wood. Oh, yes. And this is how we keep our factory going. And I don't want to go after him. Okay. Uh, I see it. Like in a little crater. There it is. There it is. Oh, oh, okay. Where's our dance partner? Ooh, there's our dance partner going behind the crash. There it is. Okay. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, crap. They saw me. Okay. Come here. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Peekaboo. Peekaboo. Oh, you got trapped. Damn, that took a few hits. Okay. Oh, reinforced iron blade. Oh, man, I forgot about them having extra supplies here. Oh, yes. Yes. This will help. We need some bigger items. <gasps> Rotors. Yes. Oh. Rods. I'll take them. Okay, anything else floating? Oh, concrete, concrete. Yes, yes, we need concrete. 124. Nice. Okay. Um, open drop pod. Pull handle, open door, and we'll get our first hard drive. Oh, come on. Yes. Talk to me, Ada. Damaged hard drive successfully acquired. All pioneers are contractually obliged to preserve and secure any recovered hard drives for analysis in the MAM. Okay. Which result in benefits to the fix it mission. Speculation as to why there are crashed freighters in your fix-it designated zone is discouraged as specified in your contract. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, there's somebody walking. Okay, okay, let's not push our luck. Let's not push our luck here. Let's go back to our fuel factory, drop off uh, what we have. And, yeah. Ooh. Okay. Definitely didn't go the way I thought this episode was going to go. I thought we were just going to make the power supply. 
or our, our power factory. Get power up and running. <gasps> Is that sulfur? Oh, let's get it. Okay, we're far enough along. Unknown chemical element collected. This non-metallic and multivalent element seems to be present only in a solid state and exhibits a most pungent smell. It is fortunate fixit helmets are of such high quality. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Uh oh. Toro, Toro. Ah! Okay. Nuts. Got to get the nuts. All right. Let's do some more clear cutting. There we go. And I get. Yep. Oh no, I didn't get you guys. Okay. Let's grab those. Sorry, guy. Okay. Yeah, this is this should last us uh, a good while, a good while, definitely. Uh oh, are we filling up? Nope, not yet. Because we can even build our starter factory and have it kind of wind around all of these little outcroppings. And I saw some more berries, which we will take. Let's see here. We could build a ramp and get that tree, but oh. Ooh. We'll let it stand. Maybe it'll produce some seeds and it'll uh, have them help it grow more trees down the lo down the road. And I just because the trees don't grow back. Not unless there's an update. Uh, OK. So we will put wood in here. And leaves over here. Ah, there. And, okay, it's consuming 12 and we've got a capacity of 420 hot damn. I will, I will be a lot more comfortable as soon as everything starts backing up along here. Just Gotta let the factory do its thing while we're out doing something else. And I'm not going to connect it up over here to the our other factory yet. Because we st I still want to still move the starter stuff over here. But let's, uh, let's go research some stuff. Uh, I think we've earned it. Uh, and why can't we pick... Oh, we can't... Why can we, how come we can't pick up all the wood? Or wait, was it the hitbox that changed? Oh, okay. I'll have to pay closer attention next time. All right. Um, hard drive. Nope, nope. Uh, what do we got? Uh, nope. Nope. Nope, we didn't get any of it. Alien technology. Um, oh, yeah, Mercer Sphere. There it is. Okay. Start research. Thank you. Confirm. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Oh, oh, completed. oh, established local planetary signature of massage two a B B in the local Mercer sphere signals, allowing them to be tracked by the object scanner. Mercer spheres can also transmit data between specific. What is our scripture? What is our windows? Have you come to the file or shrine? Since what the, f the existence of intelligent alien life. While Fixit has figured out the method, all of the original data is still untranslatable. Okay, something keeps interrupting us. Okay, mycelia, let's get this. What did all this open up? Ooh. Yes. The mycelial networks of these fungi possess unusually resilient hyphae, which show potential for making a strong but lightweight natural fabric. Additionally, it has similar medicinal and pest control applications to mycelia on Earth. Okay. Uh, nutrients. No, we got all that. No, oh, we don't have enough for that. Uh, power slugs. Yes. Yes, we do. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's go get them. Because we've got some over here in our storage. Oh, oh, man, I forgot. You know what? Let's just take all of this because I figured we had some sort. Okay. 
Oh man, a little bit of everything on this episode. Okay, alien technology. No, uh, yeah, there. We'll, we're, we're just going to research everything, even though this one's already open. My, com my OCD is kicking in. The remains researched belong to an organism that tends to nest near objects emitting specific types of resonance. Spitters are called as such due to their ability to create and spit plasma across the Yeah. Distances. Spitter remains can now be made into alien protein, and additional research may reveal options for improving pioneer safety during exploration. Okay. Let's see. Sam. Okay. And a summer sloop. Okay, mycelia. We got nutrients. You know, we got that uh, power slugs. That's here we go. Boom. So, yes. Ah. This semi slug, now dubbed power slug, is early in its life cycle and has retained only part of its potential energy storage capacity, giving it its blue color. Power slugs are capable of extracting latent energy from their surroundings, including through a form of photosynthesis, and preserve it in their porous semi-crystalline shell over their lifetime. This explains why they rarely move after having found a suitable location. Oh, that explains a lot. Quartz. Oh, really? He's, uh, we've got company here, really curious on what we're doing. Oh, silica, we should make some silica so we can get... <gasps> Uh, the blade okay little by little we're getting there okay sulfur let's get sulfur oh man okay oh. this unknown chemical <laughs> was in reality an unusual mixture of solid sulfide and sulfate materials from which sulfur can be extracted sulfur's primary use lies in fertilizers which we have no use for okay Instead, this element enables access to more volatile obstacle clearing. And yeah. Defending tools. <laughs> yes. Yes. Gunpowder, and maybe we'll get to uh, um, a rifle. Unknown metal. Do we have to get Sam? Okay. Oh, no. Hard drives. Okay. Now, they said they changed this around. Okay. Scan hard drive. How long? 10 minutes. Okay. We'll check it out next episode. Oh. All right. Yeah. Boom. Okay. Let's see. We'll just return some of our stuff here and get that and that. Oh, and we still got some wood, some quartz. Uh, let's see. We'll put that. The sulfur away. Um, silica. Uh, limestone we got. Oh, and we'll put that one. And mycelia. And... Rotors? Okay, that's right. We picked up all that from that crash site. All right. Um, let's go drop off the limestone here. And we'll clean up after our expedition that we did. Boom. And we'll put some limestone in there. How's our concrete doing? Yes, very nice. Okay, we'll get it. We'll get a full stack of 500. There we go. All right. Oh man, and those those reinforced iron plates that that helped. Uh, build some more constructors, but we haven't even. Okay, one thing at a time. We will get there. We will get there. Slowly but surely, because we need concrete and metal plates, iron plates for. Can I get up there? No, I can't. Okay, let's put you... Uh, hmm. What if we bring it up over this direction? Yeah. There we go. There. Okay, that'll make it much easier. Uh-oh. What, what happened? Oh. What, no, we... Oh, it's, it's this one. It's... Ugh. Okay. So we can help it along. So if we take out all this biomass. Shove it in here. Okay, there we'll help it along a little bit. We can put some more biomass in there. Ah! Mark II belts. We need them. Okay, let's put the wood in there. And leaves. 
We'll sort. There we go. Oh, you know what? Let's do this. Um, actually, let's do this. Um, what if we go from here? And where's... There it is. Boom. Ta-da. Made it. All right. Let's clean up our mess. There. All right. Uh, one power plant started. And we'll keep this uh, for the rest of the game, uh, just in case, because we will be losing power every now and then. But thank you for joining me on this journey in Satisfactory. And as always, enjoy life and be safe. And drink the dew.